Sit down, shut up, and listen. Sorry, I didn't mean to yell at you, but the problem I'm addressing is people's lack of attention here. People paying attention to things is what I'm addressing. People do not seem to read all the way through when they're looking at things on the internet. Like, let's say it's a forum about some news article that happened. This is a thing that happened. People will read the first sentence of what someone said. Oh, I believe X happened because of this article. And then they go in and respond all full of vitriol. And I'm outraged that this thing happened. And how could it be? And had they read two sentences down, they would have discovered that, in fact, the person was either jesting or making a synopsis of someone's commentary in there but they did not get the real point. Maybe what they said is in opposition to what actually is being said or has nothing to do with it. But either way, because they only read about a sentence or two, maybe they read one comment down and they did not do the research, they end up looking like a fool because they responded to something that actually wasn't even there or that was being made fun of. And as this pertains to YouTube, there's so many goddamn people out there that will go into a video, watch maybe 30 seconds, maybe up to a minute, and give some half-cocked comment that has nothing to do with the actual substance of the video. And along with that, by the way, it was covered in a caveat about five seconds after you left the fucking video, you moron. I understand because I too do this from time to time. I am not going to be a hypocrite and say that I don't. Regardless of the fact that I'm a hypocrite does not change the fact that I'm right about the fact that people need to actually look into these things, know what they're talking about, actually watch a whole video before giving commentary. Otherwise, you honestly don't know if you're even contributing anything to the, con to the conversation that's already being had. Maybe that part of the conversation has already been had in the four minutes you didn't watch. The reason I bring this up is it's not just because you look like a fool, but it limits the fact that there can be real conversation on a topic. You might have something very valuable to input on this idea had you understood it fully. Had you clicked on the link, read the story, or read the entire paragraph the guy said about whatever was happening instead of just the TLDR part and then jump to extra conclusions. Had you just read further down, you would have had the full scope of what was being talked about, and then you could have made an intelligent and perhaps productive comment, which had helped people along. But instead, because you read one sentence and decided to jump on in as though you knew exactly what was going on, you didn't know what was going on, and further, you just looked like an idiot. For your own good, I advise you to be more aware of what is being said before you respond to things. But it's not just for your own good, it's for everyone's good, because we can avoid a lot of misunderstandings this way where you jump and yell at somebody for something they may not have even done or, oh no, they didn't do that, they saw it and actually did something about it, but you're yelling at them because you read the first sentence. Just don't fall into that trap is my point. It's a simple trap to jump into something, but just understand something, read further, perhaps click the links, do some research, and understand. Maybe the person who made the first post you're trying to respond to actually made an error. I've seen it before where they think a story says something and it doesn't. Had you read further, you may have discovered this yourself and caught the error. But if you just go on what the guy says, don't click the link, don't do any further research, you're ignorant of the subject and you're only going to contribute ignorance. It's not a denigration of you, it is a truth. If you speak in ignorance, you will have ignorance. If you speak with knowledge, you will create knowledge. Just something to think about.